Drawing curves in Land 1 is very simple to do. To start with, I'm going to show you how this feature is activated. You'll notice over here in the left hand sidebar, there's a box that says Smooth Curves. I can click it to activate Curve Drawing Mode. I can also do this by hitting the C key on the keyboard as a shortcut. You'll notice when I'm in Curve Drawing Mode, my cursor is now changed to orange just to let me know that I'm in that mode. To draw curves, I simply click along the plan and you'll notice a smooth curve is drawn between each point. Now let me show you how this curve can be edited. Let me close out my active drawing mode and enter selection mode. I can select this line and you'll see that I have these vertices and control points that are colored orange that indicate these are all curved control points. To edit it, I simply grab a curve and I can drag it out. I can add a new point along the line by hovering over the line and clicking to add the point. If I want this to be a curved control point, simply double click the new point and it activates and becomes a curved control point. Now let me show you how I might use this feature in a takeoff scenario. I'm going to delete this curve line. I'm going to measure this mulch bed right here, so I'm going to click on my mulch material. So I'm going to do a, a takeoff of this bed how I normally would, clicking. Now when I get to my curve point, I can hit the C key and I can turn on curves. And so I can drop some curved lines around and I can hit the C key again and turn off my curves to drop a right angle. I can hit C again to finish this last curve and I'll double click to finish. Now in order to edit it and smooth it out, I close out the tool, enter selection mode as normal, and I've moved these vertices around until I got it the way I wanted it to be maybe dropping a couple of others. Now that's one way to do it. Now I'm going to show you a different way. Since toggling on and off the curves while you're actively drawing for a complex shape can be a little bit tedious, let me show you a different method using this side area here. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to do my normal takeoff, leaving my cursor in the normal drawing mode. Now I'm just going to click and add some points and I'm not going to worry about trying to get exactly around this curve. And I'm going to finish up my angles here. Now let's enter selection mode and let's add some curved points to smooth out these curves around this area. You can see it's very simple. Again I'm going to hover over the line, I'm going to click, and I'm going to double click and change it to a curved vertice. Let's add one more to finish this up, maybe one more down here, and there you go. It's a nice, smooth curves around this side area and a nice finished takeoff.